Several areas in Texas, September 2, 2024. You guys, look at my Jeep. <laughs> and another car got stuck. The National Weather Service has alerted Odessans that between 4 and 5 inches of rain have fallen northwest of Odessa, with flash flooding ongoing. Although rain rates have diminished, any extra rainfall will only exacerbate flooding already occurring. The flash flood warning was issued Labor Day Monday around 2.30 p.m. by the National Weather Service and is estimated to last until 7.30 p.m. tonight. However, rain will consistently fall until midnight with spotty showers throughout the morning and into the afternoon. Weather radar also showed that thunderstorms producing heavy rain are expected to fall at a rate of 2 to 3 inches in one hour, with flash flooding ongoing, especially in Odessa. Galveston is underwater. Get out. Reports of vehicles throughout the city of Odessa having stalled out or trapped in the road have also been made by drivers throughout social media, warning others to stay home due to the flooded roads. According to the Texas Department of Public Safety, flash flooding is the number one weather-related killer in Texas, with more than 50% of all flash flood fatalities nationwide involving vehicles. There has been flooding reported on Broadway Street as well as significant flooding reported on Stewart Road between 81st Street and 75th Street. Some street flooding has also been reported near Moody Gardens. According to the National Weather Service, Galveston has recorded 5.53 inches of rainfall as of 1.40 p.m. The Weather Service says while light rain is still ongoing and totals will be higher by the end of the day, it is already a new rainfall record for September 2. <laughs> if you are out on the island, be careful when traveling on flooded roadways. Turn around, don't drown. If the road in front of you is covered with water, don't assume the depth is something your vehicle can handle. Find an alternate route and stay safe. Urban flooding is also possible in developed areas with easily overwhelmed stormwater drainage systems. Sites located downstream from large reservoirs or rivers may be subject to flash flooding after relatively short periods of intense rainfall. Landslides are possible in hilly or mountainous areas, especially where the soil has become saturated by heavy rainfall. I could just imagine if we get three, four days of rain. Localized business disruptions may occur in low-lying areas. Some businesses might not operate at full capacity because of flood damage to facilities, possible evacuations, and some employees' inability to reach work sites. Transport, electricity, and telecommunications disruptions are also possible in areas impacted by flooding. <laughs> 